Look, at the moment, I think, and I think everyone would agree, that churches have an inordinate influence on politicians and on parliament. And we've only got to see the things like stem cell research or even same-sex marriage, that the influence that the church has had on politicians and on governments. And we need to separate that. And I think there's a number of ways we do that, but certainly I'd like to see politicians that have you know, deep connections with church groups or church organisations telling us that because we're giving thousands and millions of dollars of taxpayers' money to churches. So I'd like to know if those politicians are linked to those churches. The other thing I think we need to question is things like the chaplaincy program. You know, we're spending, I think we've spent like $500 million on that, um, and it's prophetising one religion. Now, I don't think that's the role of governments to be doing that. That's something for the home. You know, freedom of religion and freedom from religion. Um, and this is the way I think we do need to keep religion really out of politics. Authorised by R Swan for the Australian Sex Party, Canberra.